Somebody was recently asking me about the memory configurations for VMware Fusion, specifically about the uh, fact that you can't extend the memory beyond 8 gigabytes. So to show you what I mean, if you look at the settings of your virtual machine under the processors and memory, you can't specify a memory range yet above 8 gigabytes. If you try, let's go for 10 gig for example, you get an error saying that it's uh, an invalid memory size and it has to be between 4 and 8 gig. Sorry, between 4 megabytes and 8 gigabytes. So what I'm going to do is show you how to actually manually set that uh, memory size um, so you can actually get larger memory if you want. The way you do it, right click on your virtual machine, show in finder, there we go. If you then right click on your um, package, show package contents, the file you're looking for is the name of your virtual machine with VMX on the end. So there it is, mine, that's mine. So if you right click on it, open with, open it with text edit. Okay, now in that file there will be a mem size specifier. There we go, there's ours. You can see that it's specified at 2 gigabytes, so 2048 megabytes. So what I'm going to do is change that to 10 gigabytes, 10 to 40. There we go, so let's save it. Let's close down the finder window and now we'll just start the virtual machine. Okay, you get a warning to say that it's um, set with an unsupported memory size. Just okay that. Let the server start. There we go. So once it's ready, we'll log into it and have a look. If we pop into Task Manager, okay. So if you look in there, you'll see we've got two cores allocated, and we have have 10 gigabytes of RAM allocated. So so we've managed to achieve what we're after. Um, it is listed as unsupported. Personally, I, I've, I've used it a few times and it seems to work well enough. I'm, I tend to use it for um, certain server products that insist on having certain amounts of RAM to install. And then what you can do is you can wind it back in once the product's installed. Um, yeah, so, so hopefully you'll have a bit of success with that, but it certainly seems to work for me.